Hi guys, this is Sushmita, your crypto guide and today I'll be talking about circulating supply. The term circulating supply refers to the number of cryptocurrency coins or the tokens that are publicly available and circulating in the market. The circulating supply of a cryptocurrency can increase or decrease over time. For example, the circulating supply of Bitcoin will gradually increase until the max supply of 21 million coins is reached. Such a gradual increase is related to the process of mining that generates new coins every 10 minutes on average. Alternatively, coin burn events like once performed by Binance cause a decrease in the circulating supply, permanently removing coins from the market. The circulating supply refers to the coins that are accessible to the public. The total supply is used to quantify the number of coins in existence, that is, the number of coins that were already issued minus the coins that were burned. The total supply is basically the sum of the circulating supply and the coins that are locked up in the escrow. Max supply quantifies the maximum amount of coins that will ever exist, including the coins that will be mined or made available in the future. Moreover, the circulating supply of cryptocurrency can be used for calculating its market capitalization, which is generated by multiplying the current market price with the number of coins in the circulation. And this was all about circulating supply. To know more about such technical terms, do write in our comment section below and do not forget to subscribe to our channel.